deleting a device from the app. First we need to open the app, select the device we wish to remove, select the three dot icon near the top right of the display, scroll to the bottom of the display and select remove device, then confirm. This has removed the Wi-Fi product from the app. Now power down the product for approximately five seconds or so just to allow all the settings to clear. Power the device back up, press and hold the button for approximately five seconds on the Wi-Fi product until you see the blue indicator light flashing rapidly. Once the indicator is flashing rapidly, press the plus icon at the top right of the display, select electrical outlet, and then confirm indicator rapidly blink at the bottom. If your Wi-Fi password is not already entered in the field, enter your password and then select confirm. And wait for the product to pair with the app. Once the Wi-Fi indicator stops flashing rapidly, the device is paired with the app and will be ready to use once the indicator has reached 100% in the app's display. The device is now connected. It should have retained the name that you gave it previously, but if you wish to change the name, select the pen icon. You can now rename to whatever you like and select save. Then select done at the bottom of the display and the device is connected to your app. You can check this by pressing the button in the middle of the display to see whether the product is switching and it should switch on and off with the indicator in the app. Because we have deleted the Wi-Fi product and it has been reconnected, you will need to reprogram the device. So to do this, select the program icon bottom left of the display, select add, enter your on off program on hours, on minutes, off hours, off minutes, select the days you wish this program to run then save this program has now been added you can go back to the device overview and you can see the program has been entered and it's displaying near the bottom left of the display and your device is ready up and running and the time base is correct you can now leave the app